Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlogmas. Today is day six of vlogmas and I just want to do something really simple, really easy. Vlogging for five days straight and trying to get videos up has been exhausting. So today I'm going to keep it as simple as possible and I'm going to do the Holly Jolly Christmas tag, which is basically a list of questions that I'm going to answer about Christmas. And I even dressed up for you guys and I put on a festive holiday shirt. Let's just go ahead and get into this so that I can cross this day off as being filmed and move on with my life and you guys can move on with your life. Number one is favorite Christmas movie. I would have to say my favorite Christmas movie would be Chevy Chase, uh, Family Christmas Vacation. Love that movie, I grew up with it. I've watched it probably a hundred times. I quote it year round. Definitely my absolute favorite uh, Christmas movie. Number two, are you on the naughty list or the nice list? Honestly, <laughs> I think one that depends on who you're asking two I think it depends on what day it is um I would say maybe I would say a good 50 50 it just kind of depends on what kind of mood Santa's in and what kind of activities I've recently been involved in number three show us an embarrassing Christmas photo you know what I have asked my mom for a Christmas photo and I will probably get that when I get the other hundreds of thousands of photos that I've asked her for over the last 36 years. Um, if I get it before I post this video, I will definitely include it. Most likely, I'm not gonna get it. Have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes, we live in Indiana, central Indiana to be exact. So just about every Christmas is white. Many are blizzardy. Do you start Christmas shopping on Black Friday? or do you wait until the last minute guys you know me I'm the biggest procrastinator you all know that I wait until the last minute to do everything including Christmas shopping I do go out on Black Friday mainly to laugh at the people who are hustling and bustling and basically killing each other to get a deal but then I'm sure they're the ones who go out on Christmas Eve laughing at the people like me who are randomly grabbing anything <laughs> My cockatiels are even laughing at me, so there's your answer. If you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Oh my gosh, I think that I would probably, if, if, if a Christmas movie described me that I was in because of personality, it would definitely be Bad Mom's Christmas. Um, if I could choose to be in a Christmas movie, it would be Elf. I would have a blast with Elf, uh, especially when he's just like spinning around and the uh, rotating door, yeah, I would totally be game and be like, yeah, let's do it. Name all of Santa's reindeer. Oh my gosh, I can barely name all of my kids' names and I only have three. Okay, um, there's Donner and Dasher. Wait, are there eight or nine reindeer? Blixen, Dixon, Vixen? Ah. Uh, Wait, I can use my shirt as a guide. Uh, Donner, Dasher, Dixon, Blixen, Vixen. Is Vixen? Vixen doesn't sound right. There's three more. Who's the other three? Ah, uh, Prancer, um, Dancer? I know they all rhyme, right? I want to say Jupiter, but psh, that's not, that's a planet. Um, not a reindeer. Pluto? Was he a reindeer or was he, he was another animal? Was it Pluto? Is there a reindeer named after a planet? I, I can't even think of the song. I don't Cupid. I think there's a reindeer named Cupid. Gosh, now I feel like I'm getting into mythology. Okay, I don't know. I went from reindeer to planets to now mythology. I, I don't know. Final answer is Cupid. When does your family put up your Christmas tree and who decorates it? Well, because I'm the one who puts it up. Um, it is according to my procrastination schedule and I believe last year we put up the tree December 22nd. Now, we, the kids and I, are the ones who end up decorating the tree. Anthony is always at work. However, I'm hoping this year he can not be at work and he can actually put at least something on the tree. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? 
our Christmas tree is 100% fake. It is actually like a plastic Christmas tree. It's white and it has metal hinges and it comes apart in three sections and yeah, it is as fake as fake can be. It's also 13 years old and we're lucky if all three sections light at the same time. Uh, peeking at gifts or be surprised. 100% be surprised. I do not peek at presents. You can literally lay a bag on the table and say that's your present, whether it be birthday, Christmas, random, spontaneous, Valentine's Day, anniversary, and I will not ever look in that bag. Show us your ugly Christmas sweater if you have one. I don't have an ugly Christmas sweater. This is about as good as it gets, and I think it's cute because it said squad goals and yeah I don't know if you guys can see the bottom of it but I got it like two Christmases ago and I wear it every year for Christmas because I'm lame if you could be under the mistletoe with anyone who would it be I want to say my husband I feel like I should say my husband I should say my husband yeah we're gonna leave it at my husband does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make Yes, so, and I will be doing a video for this because I feel like I need to share this with you. I think you guys need this recipe in your life. Uh, my family are, okay, so we have a Jewish background and my dad has this cookie that he absolutely loves. He calls it a hunky cake and it's honestly like a cookie with like a marmalade or a jam. I personally do not like them, but I make them for my dad and it is a tradition I love to help make. Are you a pro present rapper or do you fail miserably? Um, I'm the worst rapper ever. I'm the kind of person that when I wrap a present, I never know how to judge how much paper I need. So I typically have to tape on another piece of paper. And usually I've just ran out of whatever the first paper is that I have used. And so it's typically like a completely different wrapping paper. So I'll start out with like a green ranger wrapping paper. And then I have to like tape on like this awkward looking square shape of, I don't know, like blue, um, Santa Clauses or something. Have you ever gone Christmas caroling? Yes. When I was in Girl Scouts, we used to go to the nursing homes and we would Christmas carol all of the time. And I absolutely loved doing it. And it really put a smile on people's faces. I thought about seeing if somebody d does it locally, like a church or something, to see if I could get my kids involved. But yes, I have done it. I love it. It is the most amazing thing you can do for people, especially if people don't have people to spend the holidays with uh like loved ones what tops your tree uh well we used to have a toilet paper snowman that my friend sarah made us and i forget what happened to it but we don't have it anymore so now we have an angel with soraya's face that tops the tree and it really ticks my boys off because they're like oh yeah like she's not perfect enough already but now she also tops our christmas tree do you make new year's resolutions do you stick to them yes i do make new year's resolutions i never stick to them i'm really bad at making new year's resolutions and i think the first one i always make is i'm gonna stick to my new year's resolutions i make resolutions probably on a monthly basis if not a weekly basis and i fill out those too and the final question you have been granted one christmas wish what will it be if i could have one christmas wish to grant that would be that my grandmother and my grandfather on my mom's side could come back to life so that um, I could spend the Christmas holiday with them. Um, my grandma died when I was two and my grandfather my grandfather died when I was three and I know I don't have any memories of my grandmother and I only have still memories of my grandfather and I just really feel robbed uh, with not getting to get to know them. I don't know, I wanna see what kind of people they are. I wanna see what their traditions are. I want a Christmas hug from my grandma and grandpa. I'm gonna go cry now because that was an emotional ending to what I thought was gonna be a really fun video. All right, you guys, well, that is uh, day, I think I said it was day six. It's day December 6th. Let me look at the calendar. Yes, today is December 6th. So that was a Vlogmas for today. Have a great day, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.